in today's video guys i'm gonna share with you guys five golden rules to become a successful lapstick dribbler in fc24 pay close attention here guys the first rule is you guys need to purchase a player with a technical play style like as you can see the symbol indicates everything that's what you guys need to do like the symbol as you guys can see it's a zigzag symbol and at the bottom what it says there reaches a higher speed when performing control sprint and performs wide turns keyword wide turns while dribbling with more precision so that's the first golden rule purchase a player with us play style the second most important golden rule will be is how do you position your thumb when you elastic dribbling there's a correct way and there's an incorrect way i'm going to explain the incorrect way and say why is it incorrect and the correct way we're going to get into that look here this is the incorrect way look at my thumb the, the top of my thumb i'm elastic dribbling just watch look how much basically control i have with the top of my thumb and how much grip i have a lot, lot of people go like us when they left stick dribble you know the top of their thumb and you know they go like that with the top of their thumb you have not much control why i say that because look you hardly have grip now that's the incorrect way because you hardly have grip number one when you left stick dribbling the correct way will be the base of your thumb what's the base of your thumb this whole section here so it's more you have to when you left stick dribbling you have to use more of the base of your thumb look here like us here look how my thumb is sitting this is the correct way see you must make your thumb sit like that and while it's sitting like that you must like apply pressure on the left stick you see your thumb must sit on the left stick like as you guys can see like look you must sit on the left stick and you must use like your whole thumb like look how i'm moving if i go this direction i'll make my thumb like sit on it not just the base if i go this direction as you guys can see so that's the second golden rule use the base of your thumb different directions just like change the position of your thumb like us here as you guys can see and look how my thumb is moving so practice this because when we playing fc24 we want to have good muscle memory if i'm going this direction i'll move like that as you guys can see look how my thumb is sitting this direction i'll move like that okay so we want to remember and also when we left stick dribbling we want to be gentle on this left stick as you guys can see look how i'm moving in motion so remember that second golden rule the third golden rule will be practice elastic dribbling in circular motion also because when your opponent's coming for you you can dribble in circles okay look here we spoke about the positioning of the thumb circular motion as you guys can see and look i'm taking tiny tiny steps i'm moving my elastic all around as you guys can see and i'm being gentle with it so i want you guys to practice this here circular motion from different directions look going this direction now going the other direction turning this is circular motion so also remember this here practice it let your left stick go all the way around push it and yes guys this is the second the third golden rule i mean the fourth golden rule will be use elastic dribbling to keyword create space not to beat your opponent like watch her i'm going into the empty space i'm not worried about beating him passing the ball around empty space passing the ball around creating space i see that players free see i never focus on the percentages there so remember this here guys use elastic dribbling to create space like here look i'm pushing pushing look that player is free yeah i'm going into the empty space neymar all of a sudden is free 
and I take a shot at goal. So remember, keyword, create space. Do not worry about beating a player. The fifth golden rule will be, practice left stick dribbling from left to right from all directions and with keyword, the base of your thumb, not with the tip of your thumb. So you'll develop a good muscle memory. Like look here, I'm going this direction. Look, watch, base of my thumb. Thumb, left, right, left, right. And look how my, my thumb is gripping on the left stick. This direction, again, right, left, right, left, right, left. And with the base of my thumb, this direction, left, right, left, right. See, left, right, from here, left, right, left, right. Also from here, left, right, right, left. So remember that anyways, guys, I got some live gameplay examples, check it out. Okay, here we are in game guys, as you can see. First example, I'm gonna show you guys the incorrect way and show you guys it's not so comfortable. Like here, look, I'm using the top of my thumb. As you guys can see, look at my controller, using the top of my thumb, okay? It's not so comfortable guys, you know, and I don't have that much grip, so, the top of our, our thumbs we don't want to use guys we want to make sure we use the base of our thumbs now i'll use the base of my thumb look how much control i have on pass the ball around base of my thumb as you guys can see watch my thumb how it's placed on my left stick base of my thumb and look i'm just moving in motion on i'm gentle with the left stick as you guys can see base of my thumb look taking touches into the empty space base of my thumb Almost lost the ball there, base of my thumb. And look, even with players who doesn't have their play style, the technical play style, I'm still basically managing base of my thumb. As you guys can see, look, I'm trying to confuse my opponent. So yeah, guys, as you guys can see, look how successful it is. And so we want to make sure we always use the base of our thumb when we play. Okay, guys, that's wraps the end of this video. If you guys learned anything from this video, smash a like and subscribe to the channel anyways guys i will catch you guys in the next video now click here on this video here to learn how to place all your fingers on the controller when you're playing fc24 cheers guys that video is for the beginners